The right preparation for editing will make your workflow much smoother and save you a lot of time. Let's see the best converter for video editors and how it will help you. Hey everyone, Dums here from Wondershare Unit Converter. So here are the main tasks you might have to do before you start editing. If your video editor software doesn't support the file format you'd like to work with, files like so could include AVI, FLV, WebM, or even regular MP4 and MOV files with the wrong attributes, the easiest and quickest fix is to just convert them to the right format. Sound easy enough? Well, to do this with the converter tool in the Uniconverter, first open it up and then click on the converter tool, which you'll find right up here. Then import all of your files. Then choose an output format for all of them. And lastly, select an output folder and then click on convert all. The process is fast, especially if you have the high speed conversion mode turned on. And then after the process is done, you'll have your files that are supported by anything. When you work with footage you record, download, etc., a big chunk of the video clips might not even be needed for your project. So whilst converting, you can also trim them right within the converter tool, making them more fit for your project. To do this, click on the scissors icon here, and within this window, trim the beginning or the end of a clip, or use the cut tool to cut anywhere in the video, and then to delete a segment, easily select it, and then click on the delete icon. Alternatively, you may choose the useful parts of a video clip and export them as separate clips. To control this setting, check or uncheck this box right over here. Another useful tip for file preparation is converting the files in the proper aspect ratio even before start working with the files. This might be useful for a short form content where the aspect ratio is 9 to 16 and they're often edited directly on a phone in, for example, TikToks or Instagram's editor tool. It's very simple to do it, just click on the crop icon right over here and then in this window either choose a preset aspect ratio or set it up manually. And then you can apply the same setting to all of your clips on your batch list. The feature that will save you the most time is the Uniconverter 16's batch capabilities. You may perform these tasks on many files simultaneously, making your workflow significantly faster, especially that the converter tool in the Uniconverter 16 is by far the fastest converter tool I could recommend. And this is due to what I previously mentioned, the high speed conversion mode in the converter tool, which utilizes your computer's GPU. So if you're interested in giving this converter tool a try, make sure you get it from videoconverter.wondershare.com. But that'd be all for this video. Leave a like if you found it helpful and be sure to subscribe for more tutorial videos. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in another video.